The Ministry of Home Affairs MHA or Home Ministry IAST, Mantralaya, is a ministry of the Government of India. As the Interior Ministry of India, it is mainly responsible for the maintenance of internal security and domestic policy. The Home Ministry is headed by Union Minister of Home Affairs Rajnath Singh. The Home Ministry is also the cadre controlling authority for the Indian Police Service IPS, DANIPS and DANICS. Police I Division of the Ministry is the cadre controlling authority in respect of the Indian Police Service, whereas, the UT Division is the administrative division for DANIPS and DANICS and the All India Services Officers posted and working in the Arunachal Pradesh Goa Mizoram Union Territories cadre. Ministerial team The ministerial team at the MHA is headed by the Minister of Home Affairs, who is supported by one or more ministers of state. They are supported by civil servants assigned to them, and who manage the ministerial private offices. Senior officials Topic: Home Secretary and other senior officials. The Home Secretary is generally a senior Indian Administrative Service (IAS) officer. MHA headquarters, in addition to post of Home Secretary, has, on account of upgradations since 2008, four more officers with the equivalent rank of Secretary, Special Secretary, including one officer from the Indian Police Service. The current Home Secretary is Rajiv Gauba. Central Armed Police Forces and Domestic Intelligence Agency Chiefs of CAPFs, NIA and IB report directly to the Home Secretary, who in turn reports to the Home Minister. DGs of CAPF may also report to Special Secretary Internal Security and Special Secretary, Additional Secretary Border Management. Organization Topic Departments The Ministry of Home Affairs extends manpower and financial support, guidance and expertise to the state governments for the maintenance of security, peace and harmony without trampling upon the constitutional rights of the states. The Ministry of Home Affairs has the following constituent departments. Topic: <laughs> Department of Border Management. Department of Border Management, dealing with management of borders including coastal borders. Topic: <laughs> <laughs> Department of Internal Security. Department of Internal Security, dealing with police, law and order and rehabilitation. <laughs> Department of Jammu and Kashmir Affairs Department of Jammu and Kashmir Affairs, dealing with the constitutional provisions in respect of the state of Jammu and Kashmir and all other matters relating to the state excluding those with which the Ministry of External Affairs is concerned. Topic: Department of Home. Dealing with the notification of assumption of office by the President and Vice President, notification of appointment of the Prime Minister and other ministers, etc. Topic: Department of Official Language. Dealing with the implementation of the provisions of the Constitution relating to official languages and the provisions of the Official Languages Act, 1963. <laughs> Department of States Dealing with center-state relations, interstate relations, union territories and freedom fighters pension. Divisions 
These are organizational divisions of the ministry itself, without the splitting into specialized departments. Administration division Handling all administrative and vigilance matters, allocation of work among various divisions of the ministry and monitoring of compliance of furnishing information under the Right to Information Act, 2005, matters relating to the Order of Precedence, Padma Awards, Gallantry Awards, Jeevan Ruksha Patak Awards, National Flag, National Anthem, State Emblem of India and Secretariat Security Organization. Border Management Division Matters relating to coordination by administrative, diplomatic, security, intelligence, legal, regulatory and economic agencies of the country for the management of international borders, the creation of infrastructure like roads, fencing and floodlighting of borders, border areas development program pilot project on multipurpose national identity card and coastal security. Center State Division The division deals with center state relations, including working of the constitutional provisions governing such relations, appointment of governors, creation of new states, nominations to Rajya Sabha, Lok Sabha, interstate boundary disputes, overseeing the crime situation in states, imposition of president's rule and work relating to crime and criminal tracking network system CCTNS, etc. Coordination Division Intra-ministry coordination work, parliamentary matters, public grievances PGs, publication of annual report of the ministry, record retention schedule, annual action plan of the ministry, custody of classified and unclassified records of the ministry, internal work study, furnishing of various reports of scheduled castes, scheduled tribes and persons with disabilities, etc. Topic. Disaster Management Division Responsible for the response, relief and preparedness for natural calamities and man-made disasters except drought and epidemics. The division is also responsible for legislation, policy, capacity building, prevention, mitigation and long-term rehabilitation. Topic. Finance Division the division is responsible for formulating, operating and controlling the budget of the ministry under the Integrated Finance Scheme. <inaudible> <inaudible> Foreigners Division The division deals with all matters relating to visa, immigration, citizenship, overseas citizenship of India, acceptance of foreign contribution and hospitality. Freedom Fighters and Rehabilitation Division The division frames and implements the Freedom Fighters Pension Scheme and the schemes for rehabilitation of migrants from former West Pakistan, East Pakistan and provision of relief to Sri Lankan and Tibetan refugees. It also handles work relating to enemy properties and residual work relating to evacuee properties. Human Rights Division The division deals with matters relating to the Protection of Human Rights Act and also matters relating to national integration and communal harmony in Ayodhya. Internal Security Division 1 Internal security and law and order, including anti-national and subversive activities of various groups, extremist organizations, policy and operational issues on terrorism, security clearances, monitoring of ISI activities and Home Secretary level talks with Pakistan on terrorism and drug trafficking as a part of the composite dialogue process. Internal Security Division 2 
Division deals with arms and explosive, letters of request for mutual legal assistance in criminal matters, National Security Act, 1980 and representations thereunder, administration of Narcotics Control Bureau, providing central assistance to victims of terrorist, communal and naxal violence, matters relating to breach of privilege of MPs, etc. Jammu and Kashmir Division The division deals with constitutional matters including Article 370 of the Constitution of India and general policy matters in respect of Jammu and Kashmir and terrorism, militancy in that state. It is also responsible for implementation of the Prime Minister's package for Jand. Judicial <inaudible> <inaudible> Division <inaudible> Legislative aspects of the Indian Penal Code IPC, Code of Criminal Procedure CRPC, and also the Commission of Inquiry Act. It also handles matters relating to state legislations, which require the assent of the President under the Constitution, political pension to erstwhile rulers before independence, mercy petitions under Article 72 of the Constitution. <laughs> Left-wing extremism division Control of left-wing extremism in India, as Naxalism and Maoism. <laughs> Northeast Division The division deals with the internal security and law and order situation in the northeastern states, including matters relating to insurgency and talks with various extremist groups operating in that region. Topic. Police Division 1 Division functions as the cadre controlling authority in respect of Indian Police Service and also deals with the award of President's Police Medals for meritorious, distinguished service and gallantry, etc. Topic. Police Division 2 This division deals with the policy, personnel, operational including deployment and financial matters relating to all the Central Armed Police Forces CAPFs, including BSF Air Wing. It also deals with the matters relating to welfare of the serving and retired CAPF personnel and the deployments in UN peacekeeping missions. <laughs> Police Modernization Division the division handles all items of work relating to modernization of state police forces, provisioning, procurement of various items for modernization of central police forces, police reforms and police mission. <laughs> Policy Planning Division The division deals with matters relating to policy formulation in respect of internal security issues, international cooperation on counter-terrorism, international covenants, bilateral assistance treaties and related items of work. <laughs> <laughs> Union Territories Division the division deals with all legislative and constitutional matters relating to Union territories, including National Capital Territory of Delhi. It also functions as the cadre controlling authority of the Arunachal Pradesh Goa Mizoram Union Territories cadre of the Indian Administrative Service the Indian Forest Service and the Indian Police Service as also Delhi, Andaman and Nicobar Islands Civil Service Delhi, Andaman and Nicobar Islands Police Service Besides, it is responsible for overseeing the crime and law and order situation in UTs. See also Law enforcement in India Indian Police Foundation and Institute